Hi Stays, welcome back to my channel. You guys wanted this, so it is here. I am reacting to the first take of Slump from Stray Kids. Um, I said I was going to do this yesterday, but after looking at my coursework, I was like, there's no way I'm doing this. <laughs> so, I had to be pushed, this had to be pushed back today. A lot of y'all have said this is like literally the most beautiful thing you've ever heard in your life. And honestly, it probably is because... I thought it was a great idea to, first off, the song was amazing when I first heard it. Um, I went back and downloaded the English version to my phone. Um, and honestly, I should have done the Japanese version as well. I just like thought to do the English version first. I don't know. But uh, I was like, you know what? I'm not doing anything right now. Let me go look up the lyrics to Slump. Because a lot of y'all had told me that like Han had written this when he was kind of in like a difficult headspace. So I was like, this has got to be, no one's straight kids, this has got to be important. So <laughs> it was like uh, my usual like 5 a.m. time. Um, and I was like, okay. Um, the first part of the lyrics, I was like, all right, all right. Um, you can definitely tell, uh, see the more emotional side to it. But then we got like to later on and later on in the song and I was like, okay, Emily, don't cry. Don't sob. Because honestly, I don't, I don't know when he wrote the song, but it's very relatable. Um, especially in the position, like how I related to it. Um, and so it was just like, you could, you could, after listening to it again and knowing what the lyrics said, I was like, mm, I shouldn't, I sh this is the wrong time to look up <laughs> lyrics because if it's either, honestly, if it's really, really early in the morning and I haven't slept in a while, which I hadn't slept in a while, um, I get like really, really sentimental and really, really emotional because that's like, the, <laughs> that's when my brain is like gone by that time. And that's pretty much the only time you'll ever get the emotional side out of me. Unless I'm reacting to Stray Kids. But, um, I was like, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna sit here and, like, cry myself to sleep because of Han Ji Sung. <laughs> so, um, I think I, like, tweeted about it. I did. I did tweet about it. Because I, I tweeted something, like, a few weeks ago about, like, congratulations to Han for being the Stray Kids member that makes me the most emotional. And I was like, bringing this back because it's definitely relevant right now. So, and, like, one of y'all commented, oh, did you listen to Alien? And I was like, how many songs does this man write that I can, this tweet is related to? So, um, I have a feeling I'm going to be referencing that tweet a lot during my Stray Kids journey. But with that being said, I've said a lot for this intro, um, so I'm going to go ahead and get into this. I'm really excited. Um, it looks like it's a live recording session. Like the first one was, but not... But I think it's just them. No, like, no Tower of God snippets in the middle of it. So that being said, I'm going to go ahead and get started. <웃음> 그니까 <웃음> 녹음 녹음 다 같이 써 갖고 <웃음> 와 이거 어 처음 느낌 진짜 콘덴스 마이크네 <웃음> 처음 와 보는 그런 듯한 분당인데 되게 넓은 녹음실이다. 와, 되게 좀 귀여워. <웃음> <웃음> 자, 그럼 저희 인사부터 They look so tiny. 네. 네. 오케이. 자, 여러분 알다시피 자, 여러분. 네. 하이. 세노. 세바. 보고 다치와. 실키세스. 오. I've never heard them like introduce themselves in Japanese. Oh. 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 しました。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。は
This is such a good song. Where you going? Don't let him flow it. Kono boku te ake no koste. Kona ni mo. I want it more. Was that it? Wow. Huh. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. Dang. Okay. There's like 70 things I want to talk about. Um, first off, I thought it was kind of funny that like the the rappers were like so into it, and then the vocalists were just like sitting very still, pressed against their pressing their headphones against their ear, seeing the most gorgeous falsettos, um, which. Uh, especially like Ian, um, we talked about how much he had progressed, especially in his falsettos um, for his cover. But like right there, they were still really, really strong. So um, like you could tell like from how much stronger they have gotten and it really tells you like the level he is at now um because if they're strong here and they've got even better since then and then they've gotten even better since he made that cover because in the howl and the harmony you could even tell he had been perfecting it how strong of a vocalist i am is now um which he's always been an amazing vocalist so uh chan wouldn't have picked him if he wasn't so, um, Chan, I think I even talked about this when I, f like, first talked about the song. Um, literally just, like, did everything. He was like, I'm gonna rap, I'm gonna sing, I'm gonna do my falsettos. We're just gonna cover all parts in this song. Um, so, like, fantastic job there. But, you know what? Honestly, the rap line, their, like, pronunciations were so good like you they were so clean and um of course like I don't know the Japanese language but uh 
even though like I don't know the Korean language either um, but you can tell kind of you have an idea of what they're saying because of how they enunciate things um so they just like everything sounded very clean like you could understand if you knew Japanese you could understand what they were saying and sometimes people who aren't native speakers have a hard time enunciating certain syllables when they're speaking foreign languages um so but especially saying it at that speed so like props to them because that's it's extremely difficult to do um <laughs> part of me like doesn't want to talk about Han but part of me knows like I probably should because this is his song um you can I don't and I don't know if I felt this way because I knew going into this that it was his song and he did like write this during a difficult time um and the lyrics are very emotional but when he would come in it would hit different it was it was like drawing it drew out an emotion for each of them but it was different for Han and you could tell just like watching him record like this was this was important to him um so like during during his parts I was just like internally kind of dying inside um not to don't don't take that negatively just like in a in a sense of like emotionally like I know what he's talking about I know where he's been um And to, like, even being able to express that and share that with people and share that with fans is incredible. Because a lot of people, especially people in Spotlight, tend to hide those troubles. Because sometimes maybe they think it'll make their image look bad. Which I, I hate that society is kind of portrayed it that way. Um, that, like, mental health... Um, is seen as a negative to someone rather than just like a struggle that everybody deals with or that most people deal with um so uh but uh he's just th th there's so much vulnerability in this song and you can just tell when han is singing that it's it's different for him um so also, like, I, I know I did, I'm pretty sure I might have said, like, one thing during this, but I just, for some odd reason, I didn't feel like I should talk during this reaction. Sometimes I'll say a few words in here and there, because y'all know I, like, I don't like talking during their reactions, because I just, I, I don't like talking during any reaction, because I feel like everybody should be listening to the song and listening to what, uh, the artists are doing rather than listening to my voice um but I also felt like I couldn't pause it and say anything because you don't want to interrupt the like masterpiece that's going on here which speaking of masterpiece going on here the live vocals and ra like, all of it all aspects of this song were phenomenal and the fact that it's short kind of is really sad um because this is an incredible song like in all aspects production lyrics instrumentation vocals rap all of it all aspects of it flawless um but i just didn't feel like i should i should talk during this so um the people who don't stay for my reactions afterwards probably think this reaction is utterly useless because I didn't say anything um but it should you know there's just like some things where you need to you need to sit stay quiet and listen um and that's what I felt like with this uh, but this is uh, you could mess up I mean this is this is a one take you 
live, everybody's got to be perfect. Or at least as close to perfect as they can be. And that's pretty much what they were. Um, I mean, it was... You, you couldn't ask for a better recording of that. So. Uh, that was... I, I see why y'all wanted me to react to this. I get it. Um, so. But I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Um, be on the lookout for my next Stray Kids content. I don't know what it's going to be. Um, but... Uh, whatever it is i hope you guys enjoy it um but don't forget to like subscribe comment down below whatever i don't even really like do that for like i know i guess that benefits you kinda or whatever but like if y'all don't want to like this don't like it <laughs> um however like it'd be cool if y'all commented on it because i like talking to you guys even though i haven't really gotten to the comment section in a while because um I've had school, but hopefully I can get to it here soon. Um, also, like, I mean, if you want to subscribe, I guess, subscribe. I, I don't know why y'all stay, but thank y'all. Um, but I mean, like, if, if you just, like, want to just, like, come back and enjoy my videos every so often without getting the annoying notification, because honestly, I've started getting notifications for my videos. I don't know why, but... Um, and I'm like, duff, duff. every time it pops up, I just get annoyed. <laughs> so, like, I get it. Um, but, yeah, I just, like, appreciate you guys. So, really, the main thing is, like, comment down <laughs> below. Also, follow me on Twitter um, so I can talk to y'all there. Uh, because I'm definitely more active on Twitter than I am YouTube. Um, but sometimes I even miss out on my Twitter comments because I don't think I've replied to one of my comments on Twitter yet either so um but I promise I do for the most part um reply to everything so uh with that being said I will see you guys next time bye stays